Princess Beatrice pregnant, huge hint newlywed Beatrice may be expecting. Princess Beatrice has been spotted for the first time since her honeymoon and the special outing seems to hint the newlywed may be expecting her first baby. Princess Beatrice, 32, and husband Eduardo Mapley Monsi, 36, have been spotted back in London for the first time since their secret royal wedding on July 17. The couple are understood to have honeymooned in Italy and France and their latest sighting back in the capital has prompted speculation Beatrice might be pregnant. Beatrice or Bea as she's known to family and friends was photographed visiting baby shop Little White Company in central London while husband Ada waited for her and the car. New photos of the princess show her looking chic in a blue pleated skirt and black blazer as she carries a bag from a market shop The White Company's children branch. In keeping with government guidelines, Beatrice was also wearing a face mask for the central London shopping trip. Excited royal fans commented on Beatrice's latest appearance on Twitter, with many speculating that she might be pregnant. One wrote, Oh my I'm right I guess, she's pregnant. Oh love that. Princess Beatrice will be a very good mom. Another put, I cannot be the only one thinking Princess Beatrice is pregnant. Princess Beatrice Pregnancy Odds Bookmakers Ladbrokes have slashed the odds on Beatrice announcing baby news by the end of the year. Following the royal wedding Ladbrokes have cut the odds on Beatrice giving birth in the next 12 months from 1-5 to half. Ladbrokes spokesman Alex Apati said, We are expecting a baby for Beatrice in the coming months and wouldn't be surprised to hear a pregnancy announcement before the year is out after she tied the knot back in July. Beatrice is already a stepmother to Eduardo's three-year-old son Christopher Wolf known as Wolfie. Wolfie was said to have been the best man at Beatrice and Ado's wedding and the couple are on good terms with his mother, Ado's ex Dara Huang. Dara and Ado co-parent Wolfie and Beatrice is said to be extremely fond of him. Many details about Beatrice and Eduardo's low-key royal wedding were kept secret from the public with very few official photos from the big day being released. The couple tied a knot at All Saints Chapel in Windsor near Beatrice's family home the Royal Lodge. Queen Elizabeth II, 94 and Prince Philip, 99, were among the 30 guests to attend the small ceremony and Beatrice's gorgeous wedding dress was a huge hit with fans. B borrowed a 1960s Sir Norman Hartnell gown belonging to the Queen which was updated to suit her big day. The spectacular dress which features a hand-embroidered bodice covered in crystals and diamantes captured the imagination fashion fans. Earlier this week it was announced Beatrice's wedding outfit will go on public display at Windsor Castle later this month. The Royal Collection Trust confirmed, HRH Princess Beatrice of York's wedding dress will go on display at Windsor Castle from 24 September, November 22, 2020. The display will also feature Princess Beatrice's wedding shoes, made by Valentino and previously worn by Her Royal Highness on occasions including the wedding of TRH the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge in 2011. In addition, a replica of Bee's bridal bouquet made from artificial flowers has been created for the display. The bouquet was designed by Patrice Van Helden, co-owner of RVH Floral Design, and contained trailing jasmine, pale pink and cream sweet peas. Royal Porcelain Spray Roses, Pink O'Hara Roses, Pink Wax Flower, Chamelassium Uncinitum, and Baby Pink Astilbe, as well as sprigs of myrtle in keeping with royal tradition. While Beatrice usually visits the Queen during her summer break at Balmoral every year, it is not known if she made the trip this summer. While the Queen welcomed Princess Eugenie and her husband Jack Brooks Bank at her Scottish home last month, B and Ado's honeymoon abroad may have made the visit impossible. The Queen and Prince Philip are both at high risk from COVID-19 because of their agent Beatrice and Eduardo's time in France where coronavirus cases have been rising could have posed a potential health risk. The newlyweds are likely to have had to isolate for 14 days following their return to the UK.